Good evening guys, gals and non-binary pals and welcome back to NMC Gaming and we are back in Fallout 4 and continuing our quest with the Brotherhood of Steel. When last we left our heroine, or ourselves, we were about to enter the Institute for the first time um, in this timeline, obviously the aborted timeline, the true timeline is uh, all set where we went in with the um, well representing the railroad this time is Brotherhood of Steel and I've had a thought pop into my head right as I was about to go live I just I was making a coffee just now I've been hesitant about doing this again because we've done it very recently and um, so we know what to expect but we don't do we because when we went in with you know, um, on behalf of the railroad, we were working with an espionage goal. We were looking at, um, you know, le leading the institute on, getting them on the side so we could bring them down from the inside. We don't know what the Brotherhood of Steel is going to do. However, what I am going to do is leave my power armor out here. And the reason for that is, well, I don't exactly need it if we're going into the Institute. That much I can I, I know right away I'm not gonna need that. They're not gonna open fire on me. I've checked and reached so. everything. I think the signal interceptor's ready to go. Are you? Let's do this. Let's do this. Alright. Head up onto the platform and we'll see if I can find a signal to lock onto. Okay. Pull yourself together. Yeah, so well, give me a chance to get there first. Oh, I, I can't move now. This is literally me stuck in this spot, not even in the middle. Right, everyone's talking at once. Okay, so... Can you, can you please? Yeah, probably. Yeah, she's getting pissed. Uh, that's a physical. What? I put a clever little program on this I'm sorry, I've got lightning going on all around me. I've got you yelling at me. Everyone is yelling right now. He keeps coming over to try and have a word with me, and I can't do fuck all about it. Oh, he was giving me a hard tip. Okay, so um, right, I've got to set that up. Oh, yeah, that's a lot similar to the railroad. Yeah, but we have a mission when we're in there, other than that that we've just given. Oh, shush. Yep, look him. Oh fuck you! I'm basically a rookie. You've known me a couple of weeks. At, if, if that, right. yeah. So that's our mission. We have to go find this Lee person. Hmm. And try and get her to come back to the Brotherhood of Steel. Now, I've completed the molecular level in the prime timeline, so I know I'm not getting the achievement for that. But each um, faction has their own achievements for doing this. Uh, load of holotape. Oh god. Um, what would it be? Mm, not Inisha Clark. Oh, did, I, did I look at the Inisha Clark? Clark? Don't know. Copy that one, right? Yeah, that's the one, yeah. Brilliant, so let's eject it. Go back. And I've got the scan. Okay, so I need to give that to Ingram. So this is going to be very much the same. The voice is going to come over his father and... I wondered if you might make it here. You're quite resourceful. Oh, I have to I wait until he shuts up. Mm-hmm. Yep. I know why you're here. I'd like to discuss Since I haven't been I haven't been told to get the institute on board Step into the elevator. this time, so I can basically let out my true feelings early, can't I? 
I'm not working towards a goal. For... Really? Yeah, I'm in the elevator. Can you? Oh, I didn't move. Oh, you let you wave me again in the sensor to get in here. I basically had to graze the panel. What do you think of us? Like my only goal coming in here is to try and get Lee pressure. back on side with the Brotherhood of Steel. So basically, I can. Well, I'm not going to open fire because I haven't got my power armor, but I don't have to worry about sparing feelings. This I can just lie. But I'll, I'm not lying. I can I can basically say fuck you. <laughs> you know I don't. I think you are lying to me. Uh, I, I know I'm, I, I usually say I don't talk over cutscenes and dialogue and stuff, but this is stuff that's been heard before. If you want to hear what what father's going on about, um, just turn around like dead air really. Um, you can. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah. You can check out my playthrough. Um, in, el el elsewhere on the channel, I think, in fact, same playlist, yeah. We must be oh, oh. Underground. Thank you. Yep, too much underground. Yep. See, this, this is coming for the PA, right? So everyone can hear this, right? So everyone knows I'm here. I'd like to talk to you about what we can do for everyone. Yeah, I'm just, <laughs> I shouldn't be here right now because the, the dialogue is not run out yet. Oh, yeah. I guess it. For your son. Yeah, I guess it is supposed to run out there. Sean? Huh? Yes, I'm Sean. Yeah, so since I know it's a robot, then. Sean? It doesn't really matter what I say here. Who are you? Sean. What's the Where is everyone? Father, what's going on? What's happening? Sean, are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? What's going on? Father? Father! Sean, honey? What do you want me to do? I don't know you. Go away! Father! Father, help me! Okay, the, now, now the, the robot's reaction seems very, very weird now. Who is Father? Where is he? Father? Father, help me! She's trying to take me! I said no such thing. I said no such thing. Hello, Sean. S923 recall code 0. Fascinating, but this The child's responses were not at all what I anticipated. He's a prototype, mm -hmm. understand. We're only just now beginning to explore the effects of extreme Yeah, 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 yeah. Stimuli. Please try and keep an open mind. I recognize okay, so I know the end game here, so let's find out what I'm going to say. Yeah, can we hit this? Father. <laughs> That's your name? Your title? Father is my unofficial title. It's what I've come to mean to the people of the Institute. Just as... Mm -hmm. As you are a parent to your son, to Sean. Uh, how do I, how should I go about this? Um, yeah, I don't have to get him on the side, so let's just let's be let's be sacky. All we're missing are the teacups and the white rabbit. Ah, levity, excellent. A sure sign that you adapt quickly to stressful environment. But I need you to realize that this situation is far more complicated mm -hmm. than you could have. You have traveled mm -hmm. very far. It's good to yep. finally meet you. I am your son. Mm hmm. Um, uh, how is that even? Possible. I know this is a lot to take in. In the vault. Did we hear this bit of dialogue? No concept of the passage of time. But then right, you yeah, learn that your son was no longer an infant. Is it really mm -hmm. so hard to accept that it was not ten, but sixty years? That is the okay, reality. Yeah, so, is this bit? Here I am. Mm-hmm. But 
Why? Why take a child? Why take you? Ah, now that's the question, isn't it? Why? Yes, that's why I asked it. At that time, the year 2227, the Institute had made great strides in synth production. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, this bit again. Okay. So they followed mm -hmm. the best Talk about the, the, thus far. Yeah, they need the encrypted DNA. So the weird science experiments needed specimens. That's why they took you? In a manner of speaking, yes. The Institute endeavored to create synthetic organics. The most logical... It's never explained why. Was ...human DNA. Plenty of that was available, of course. But it had all become corrupted. Even in their attempt, mm -hmm. but then the Institute found me. Mm -hmm. I was exactly mm -hmm. what they needed. I am yeah. their father. And you've... You've been down here the whole time? I have. Yes. I know you must have questions. Please. Anything I can do to help you understand. Mm hmm So, you're in charge of the Institute? Then. I am the acting director, yes. I spent decades working to reach this point. It's a responsibility I take very seriously. The Institute. It's important. It really is humanity's best hope for the future. No matter what... How? With no humans involved? They're scared of you, Sean. Scared of the Institute. People are always frightened by what they don't understand. Ultimately, the common... I understand it. I don't understand the reasons. Whatever you've seen or heard, I know... You I take people sure and replace them with robots. Give me time. What else can I say to ease your mind? Your father. He never got to see you grow up. Yes. What happened to him was... I've gone over the records of the incident, of course. It seems what happened to him was an unfortunate bit of collateral damage. For many years, I never questioned who my parents were. I mm -hmm. accepted my situation, and that was that. With old age comes regret. And asking what if more often. But what matters now is that you and I have a chance to begin again. What else can I mm -hmm. say? Not in this playthrough. There will be a playthrough where I do go with the, uh, the Institute. I think I've heard enough for now. Very well. The Institute is on the verge of some important breakthroughs. Your presence would be appreciated as we approach them. I've been a part of something amazing here. I've helped to build mm -hmm. a life for myself and the people of the Institute. Yeah. Maybe... Uh, I don't know. This is so much to take in. I know. And I am sorry. You have been through so much mm -hmm. in such a short time. The Institute yep. can provide a better life than anything above ground. You've been in the Commonwealth. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to do. I realize that. It's why I'm trying to help you. I hope that you can see that rationally. Yeah, maybe you should listen to these ones. It's the only thing left in the world that is worth being part of. I simply ask that you give the Institute, me, a chance. A chance to show you what I've been telling you. We really do have humanity's best interest at heart. Will you take that chance? Uh, I'll, I'll, say, I'll say yes, I need to find that, that, that scientist. All right. Thank you. The Institute is now your home as much as it is mine. Please take some time, get to know it. Meet the people you'll be working with. You'll want to introduce yourself to the division head, Dr. Fillmore in facilities. 
Mm. And finally, yeah, okay, Dr. Lee e in advanced systems. They've all been advanced systems, that's who we need. Go. Um. I mean, I can't go that way, can I? Oh, can I... I can go this way? Is there... No, this is just a cupboard. Yep, this is just a cupboard. So, advanced systems. We'll do that first, because that's the one I've got the mission for. Nope, this is the bedroom. Oh, I can open doors now. Okay, I thought they were just locked. Uh, so advanced systems, where are we going? Dun, dun, dun. Almost done. Are you saying? This primary drive server. Ma'am, that's the third primary drive uh. breakdown we've survived. So robotics. The phase out on these older models can't come soon enough. Food. Synthra tension, advanced systems, thank you. Oh, this is literally the one that's on my map. Okay. Let's find out how this quest goes. She's been at it for over two hours. What is she even testing? Nothing. At this point, she's just doing it for fun. <laughs> I liked her. Uh, ah, in here. Hello. Excuse me, Dr. Lee. Oh, it's you. You're not authorized to be here. Actually, I was looking for you. Me? Why? I've been sent by the Brotherhood of Steel to find you. You don't beat around the bush, I'll give you that. I knew it was just a matter mm -hmm. of time before your people would track me down. I've been looking over my shoulder for almost a decade, waiting for them to send someone like you to kill me. I'm only here with good intentions. You have my word. You're giving me your word? Even though we just met? Fine. Hmm. Since Father trusts you, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. I might not agree with okay, everything he says, but I know he'd never allow harm to come my way. Say what you came here to say, and then leave me alone. Okay. The Brotherhood needs your help, Doctor. Needs my help? Why? They seemed to have everything under control when I left. The Brotherhood valued your presence. And we'd like you to come back. Well, how sweet of them. Tell me something. Why would I possibly want to come crawling back to the Brotherhood? What reason would I have to throw away everything I've accomplished here? Father trusts me, and so should you. He trusts you because you're family. I'm not. I can't just Bastard. take your word for it. I need more than that. Okay. The Brotherhood has always been straight with you. I am getting a bit tired of all the secrets around here. Sometimes I mm -hmm, feel like father is being straight with me. Like there are things I'm not supposed to know about. I don't mm -hmm. like that. But still, how can I turn my back on all of this? Your work could be instrumental in freeing the Commonwealth. You're wasting your breath. I'm a scientist, oh, not sorry, a soldier. Failed that one. The Brotherhood desired my creations in order to destroy, to take control. I'm not interested in returning to that way of life. Mm, uh, what would it take? What would it take to convince you? All right, I'll play your game. I had a colleague down here, a Dr. Virgil. Several months ago, there was an accident in his lab. Oh, we know there, Jill. I wanted to help with the investigation, but Father had the laboratory sealed, saying that it is contaminated. The incident never sat right with me. The more I asked about it, the more I felt like Father was deflecting my questions. If you okay, bring we can tell the Virgil's alive. On what killed him, 
I'll take it as a favor from the Brotherhood and consider your offer. Do we have a deal? I know this may come as a shock, but Dr. Virgil is still alive. I, I met him myself. <laughs> oh, please. Do you really think a cheap tactic yeah. like that is going to work on someone like me? And Stop trying to avoid he's living in the glowing sea. Either you get me the evidence, or we have nothing else to talk about. Deal? Deal. Mm, no, no. All right. Dr. Virgil's lab was in the biosciences division. I can give you a I know. We'll get you into he told me. But the lab itself has been sealed, so you'll have to breach it on your own. I'd tell you to be quiet about it, but your brotherhood and discretion isn't exactly your strong suit. And finally, if you get caught, we never had this conversation. Now, for the sake of keeping up appearances, let me see that pit boy okay. of yours. I've been told to install a coarser chip in it for you. Father's orders. You're to be given full access, okay. with the ability to relay in and out of the Institute at will. There we go. Thank you. I'm sure that'll come in handy. Given that the relay is the only way to access the Institute, handy is something of an understatement. In case the significance Christ, is lost on you, nice you'll be the only one here with that kind of access. If nothing else, it should demonstrate the amount of trust Father has placed in you. Speaking of, I trust our discussion will remain between the two of us. Now, I need to get back to work, and I'm what sure discussion? you have other things to do. I don't like you. Right, uh, let's take a look at my quests. Uh... So meet the division leaders, let's get that on. Do I do that want to get out? Forget that, forget that, forget that. Right, so that's the thing I need to do. Uh, I need to do it for Virgil anyway, so... Where's Virgil's one? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I guess I'll drive the one for Virgil on. Okay. It's really exciting having you here. I can't wait to see what you can do. Hi, Doc. Hmm? Oh, hi there. Sorry if I seem distracted. I memorized five <laughs> with design schematics, and now I'm doing detailed mental comparisons. What kinds of blueprints? Mostly components for a new plasma pistol concept I've been toying with. High energy weapons mm. are sort of a hobby of mine. Anyway, I'm glad you're here. <laughs> I just wanted to say how much I admire Father, and that it's an honor to meet you. I really hope you'll stay here with us. Hmm. I wonder, on my playthrough when I'm siding with the uh, the Institute, can I try and romance her? Because she seems cool. I like her. Right, so let's go talk to the uh, the other division heads. And let's go from there. Scanning unknown we'll do, we'll do bioscience last. Because we've got so much to do in bioscience, like meeting the heads and getting Virgil's lab and everything. So it makes sense to do that all in one place. And then we we we'll have to double back on ourselves. Reporting status. Um we we'll have to double back on ourselves to meet these heads. Hello. Oh. oh god, there's so many people talking. Hello. Hello. Cosa. There's enough friction as it is between us and pretty much all the other departments. You going soft on me, Alana? My methods get results, and they will this time as well. You'll see. Mm -hmm. Like any machine, the synth can malfunction. Just wish it didn't happen. Okay, hey, Justin. Oh. Here you are. Justin Ayo, yep. acting director of the synth retention bureau. I'll be upfront with you. We're going to be keeping a close eye on you for the near future. Despite your relation to father, you're a bit of an unknown quantity. I'm sure you understand. That makes sense. There won't be any issues, will there? Why? Don't you trust me? Oh, it's nothing personal. I don't trust anyone. Now, Father has asked <laughs> that I provide you with a brief overview of the Synth Retention Bureau. 
Our primary responsibility is the recovery of escaped synths that are hiding among the human population on the surface. Mm. Why would synths want to escape? Synths do not want. They might look like human beings, but they're machines. As to why they're escaping? That matter is currently under investigation. Our main instrument is the Courser, a third generation synth assigned to operate on the surface. Coursers hunt down and reclaim synths that have escaped the Institute. They are highly self sufficient, trained in combat, and penetration, and tracking. In a word, our coursers are relentless. But I gather you know all this, since you've encountered one already. In fact, mm -hmm. I'd very much like to know how you defeated it. I'm no stranger to combat. Even so, a courser should be more than a match for any single combatant. I suppose I'll have to ask robotics to perform detailed diagnostics on the entire... I had a friend with me as well. As if we don't have enough robots. Now, unless you need something else, I'll get back to work. Mm. Uh, I'm good for now, I just have to meet you. I'm good for now, thanks. Very well. Yeah, father just asked me to meet you. Oh, where's, he, where's your friend gone? I want to talk to her. Hey, there she is. The directorate should take the synth escapes more seriously. <clears throat> I swear I spend half my time smoothing the feathers that Justin ruffles. We need to be able to collaborate with the other divisions, and that's a lot harder when they're always angry at us. If we can't get along, it's going to be hard to accomplish anything. Yeah, even worse, we got a lot of smart guys with fragile egos. Anyway, we'll figure mm. it out. It was good to meet you. Yeah, you too. I see ammo. It's not stealing, so I'm just going to take all of these cells. Thank you very much. And your rounds. I'm going to set the guns because they're heavy. Since we're in the grenade, I guess that's how I get in and out. Bug. I don't need it. Okay, we good. I saw some things. No, he wasn't stealing. So much research, so little time. Excuse me. A child sin. It's just remarkable. Mm-hmm. So where are we off to next? Well we're just following the path around, aren't we? Nothing to report, ma'am. Didn't ask. Uh yeah, into robotics. Remember to keep unnecessary power consumption to a minimum. Don't recharge unless your primary levels are below two percent. Also, if you haven't patched your navigation software, do so <laughs> after this meeting. The last thing we need is more synths bumping into walls. All right, that's all for now. <laughs> all maintenance yep. requests should be directed to the facility immediately. Is it too robotic? Is this not a place I need to go? Or is this where they dip them? Hmm. Yeah, I guess I don't need to meet you. Glad you made it. Hi. Rumor is advanced systems will be starting a new dark matter initiative soon. Dark matter initiative. Ooh, that sounds fun. No, he's just generic scientists. No heads. Okay, let's get out of here. We don't need to be here. I get through this as quick as I can. Because meeting the eggheads is uh old hat. Who's up there? Is that another head? I'll send some down here and let's do this one. Bioscience division, yeah. Then there's someone upstairs that I have to meet, I guess. Uh, we will not yet. I've been reviewing father's plans to expand our operation. Talk to you. Hello. How the war Welcome. Is doing. So good to have you here. Young Wally Dr. Dr. Clayton Holden, head of the bioscience remarkable that any child. He's a friendly guy, I like him. What we're doing, don't you think? It's truly amazing. 
Like what? I was just about to explain that. As the name implies, the bioscience division specializes in fields of study such as botany, genetics, and medicine. Our most important directive is to ensure the health and well-being of everyone in the Institute. To that end, we cultivate highly specialized breeds of flora for use in food and medicine. We've even started to explore the idea of synthetic animal life. You probably saw the gorillas. They're really just a pet project at this point, but the potential is exciting. <laughs> Lol, pet project. Seems like there's nothing you guys can't do. With hard work and ingenuity, any challenge can be overcome. I'm sure I've taken up enough of your time as it is. But I have to ask, have you decided whether you'll join us? I'm thinking about it. I'm an outsider. Would there even be a place for me here? Even if science isn't your passion, there are plenty of ways to contribute. Our projects sometimes require an agent who can work on the surface to observe and gather information. From what I've heard, you are both fearless and resourceful. I think you'd be mm -hmm. ideal for that kind of role. In any case, I imagine you'll want to continue looking around. Or, if you prefer, I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. You single? <laughs> I'm good for now. Thanks. Take care, then. He's quite cute, in an Aryan kind of way. Oh, there's the gorillas he was talking about. Yeah, okay, so... Let's try and find Virgil's lab. Found a door. Now, luckily, I kind of remember where it was from the last time. Yeah, if I remember, that was the room that I kind of got locked in. And I had to, like, talk to them through the glass, and then I set the gorillas on them. Nice. In the previous playthrough. Oh, guess not. I guess that's the way I have to go, since that's just a cupboard. So maybe I don't remember as much as I, as I thought I did. FEV lab, that's the one. It's rusty old lock on his shiny door. Fuck you. Thank you. Ching. So we find this stuff, then I guess we return to Lee, then we can meet the person that's upstairs, and... That's sneaky. Bring it right there. Mm-hmm. Keep an eye out for traps. Nothing here. Okay, we good. We good. Wait, what was it? it? It highlighted something. What did you highlight when I when I swung my camera around? Oh, right, just you. Yeah, this crappy scratch. It makes a bit more sense here since this is a a rundown bit of the institute and been abandoned for years. I oh, forgot to say, really. And I got it. Anything here worth having? Drinking glass, clip, but not a battered one. Don't want the telephone. It'd be good if there's like technical documents here. Again, be careful of traps. No motion detectors, no spotlight. Oh, but there's a turret. Okay, then. Dickhead. Time to meet some righteous authority. Oh, 
Should have reloaded for this, but hang. Ah, oh, keep me that chick, take the scope off that. Cool, that broke. Yeah, I'm going to take some red away. And then I take some back. I heard another buzz, so there's one around here. Yep. Oh, there's two, okay. Let's, let's go there. Let's get inside, let's get inside. Fuck's sake. Ah, <sighs> stuck at a door. I've got pulse grenades, I could just throw one of them. That's what I'm going to do. You. Hey, buddy, mind the long face. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's equip Whoops. weapons, pulse mines, and um, pulse grenades. Wow, nearly did it! Nearly did it. Started walking forward, remembered it was there. Just a few caps, so can't be bothered doing that again. I bounced back. Okay, so I missed. You going away? Stuck on a wall again. And the blast knocked me in. Thanks, at least I'm in now. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, I could just I'll shoot down the I'll shoot down the one that first one. Uh what do I need? Shotgun I'll do I think it'll be better. Mm hmm. Let's get that. Yep, that works a lot better. That works. We get in. That's it, you do the trick. Someone said something. Cool. Yeah. Someone down there. Look. Something buzzed. What was it? Reveal yourself. Hmm. Two bombs. I guess these aren't radiated foods. Hmm. He's trying to attack us. Yeah, I think it's the people on the other side. Uh, what have we got here? Seeds. Two, okay. Herb, that's got. That's got two. Nope. So, another ERDS. No, no, it's not you. I could could be you here. Yeah. Mm. No, okay. So what was it? Seeds had two, okay. Mm. No. Oh, no. Can we get rid of you? No. 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 Uh. Ah, uh, oh, wait, what was that? Oh, okay. It looks like it might be shitty. I'm in. Mm, throw control. Deactivate. 
So that's probably for the ones I've already blown up. Any more door. Open. around. Puncturing pipe wrench mod. I hear something. Cool. Someone here. Jesus! Where'd you come from? Getting a salt run. No warning, you just kind of snuck up on me. Huh. Oh, I got vaporized. Well, that was fucking terrifying. I well, know you warned me, but I'm to get more dangerous as to, as to get more damage. Oh, okay. Uh, if I'd have known that was there. Oh, back here, seriously? Fuck you. Fuck you. I'm not even collecting shit now, I just want to get through here. Fuck you. Fuck you. Right. Take that. Take that. Nothing? Did I throw it into the cupboard? Yes, sir. I got through the wall. I got one. Let's take another. Yeah, now fuck off. Advanced. Can't be bothered doing the hacking again, this is easier. Less, well, it's less annoying anyway. She says as she snaps the bobby pin. Oh, it's in the back there. Over there somewhere. Ah, uh, out of range. No, I'm stuck. I'm stuck in the wall. Christ, I'm just stuck in the wall here. Ah, this is it. This is irritating. I've got a pulse mine, haven't I? I'll set that by the door, then throw the, and then throw that grenade again, and move the fucking thing in. Please, please. Thank you. Take that now before I forget. Really? Oh my god. Oh my god. I wish kinda wish I brought my power armor now. I forgot about the whole Virgil's lap. Well, I didn't know that was going to happen, actually. Right, so let's take the red away. Let's take... Psycho. I can't remember if that increases my damage dealt or... Damage resistance. Either way, puts me in a better standing against Tony the turret over here. That looks like it's damaged out.
I guess they're both. Same pack. Weapons. Pulse mine. There we go. That's it. Next. And let's bring back the pulse grenade. Sensor read. Weapons cold. Mm. My side turn. Yes. Just wear around that car unless I might do some damage. Anomaly detected. Yeah, come on. Bring it. Seriously? That did that little damage to you? Ah, recover! 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 Oh my god! Oh, I need to save it before I open that door. I know it's just around a couple of corners, but just having to redo it is irritating. And I don't think the energy gun would be much better than the shotgun. Right, let's quick save. Sorry, I don't have to do that anymore. There we go, a bit closer, so that helps, I guess. And get you. And what do I have active? Cool. Heal. Yeah, let's register authority. Reveal myself, fuck you. Uh, we're gonna go with the pulse mines. One there, one there, and one there. Three, as so when it comes to the door. I'm gonna quick save. Actually, before I, before I do that, I'm going to ready my pulse grenades. Yes. Area weapons hot. What? Did I get caught by the fucking pulse mine? All right, that's fine. Throw a fragment grenade as well. Yeah, fuck it. I blew up the mines. Engaging hostile. Close the door. Close the door. Ah! Reload. Reload. Oh my god, you're not reloading. I have no idea where anyone, anyone or anything is right now. Look, let's just reload. Reload as you're running. Reload as you're running. That did some damage.
That didn't do nearly enough. See you. Oh, you're down there. Whew. Oh my fucking Christ. Now get, get you. Get. Oh my God. That was intense as shit, man. I do not remember that from the first time I played through. Then again, my power armor. Did I come a different way? Is this a different thing? Is there going to be more of them? I'm going to save. Right. Just in case there's more things around that I need to be scared of. See, so trip wires down there. Thanks, great. Mm. Well, the stim packs, class uniforms, black coats. Is the castle locker room? Let's see how they've got one. Baseball cap, stim pack. Ooh. One degree. Got some paint. Cat meat, yummy. More cat meat, we've got a couple of dead cats here. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck you, fuck. <sighs> I heard them and I was just like, fuck. Right, alright. Good thing I saved here. Now, bring out the pulse grenades again. Yeah, pulse grenades. Yeah, you're down these corridors, aren't you? So if I just get you, get you out too. Did I get them both? Yes, it did. <laughs> Show me where I am now, you bastard. Wait, do we have any more? Says, I do not remember this heavily fortified stuff. I c I've come to a different place, haven't I? This isn't Virgil's lab, is it? I do not remember this at all. There we go, got that as well. Now as for you... Right. What else do we got here? So we're going in there, that requires the terminal. It's just a novice one. Done. Nope. No. Poor, you've got right to move one. Two. Uh. Hour. There you go. Open door. Oh. Turn off the turrets. Like I say, it's just the ones that the ones I've just blown up. But did I come this way? All right, apparently I did because here they are now. Did I come through from this way somehow? I think I did. I must have come from there. That's bioscience. 
Maybe? I don't know. Let's see how that's... Take that, let's listen to it. Personal record. That's Dr. Dr. Brian Virgil. This will likely be my last recording. My requests to shut down the FEV program have repeatedly been denied. We've learned nothing useful in the last ten years. Why does Father insist on continuing it? If he won't see reason, then I have to take matters into my own hands. What we're doing... It's not right. It needs to mm -hmm. stop. If anyone should find this after... Yeah, well, listen, this room. After I'm gone. Know that I never wanted to hurt anyone. Anyone! Do you understand me? I'm gonna make sure the whole program is shut down. If not for good, then... At least for years to come. After mm -hmm. that... I know what I'm about to do will be seen as a betrayal. Treason, he'll probably call it. So, I'm leaving. I have a plan. And if it works, I'll be somewhere safe. Somewhere not even the coursers mm -hmm. can find me. Everything that we've done. The lives we've taken. Mm -hmm. If there is a God, may he have mercy on us all. There we go. Check you. Uh... This is Dr. Elliot with the official report for the Directorate from Bioscience. The date is Wait, I don't um, know if August well. 2178. I'm pleased to report that, as has been the case during my tenure, crop yields exceed expectations. In point of fact, everything down here is fine, with one notable exception. Dr. Frederick has informed me that the Directorate has pre-approved research on samples of the FEV virus which he already has in his possession. Now, I'm not one to question the Directorate, you all know that. I don't even want to know where this came from. But, well, this is troubling. Dangerous, possibly. Yeah. I will do my best to make sure risks are minimized. But I really do hope that the consequences are understood. Ooh. Sorry, I was just trying to thing in my living room there. Ah. Let's take you as well. This is Dr. Elliot reporting for the Bioscience Division. March 22-24. We just received another batch of subjects. But as my previous report stated, we're at an impasse here. More of the same won't help. The two most promising strains of FEV have been adapted to an ideal state, but... We're still missing something. I am officially echoing the team's position. The most likely progress for our research on synthetic organics requires new avenues of exploration. Additional Commonwealth subjects will not help. Mm -hmm. It's the same problem across the board. Exposure to too much radiation. We need mm -hmm. something... Someone new. There's a proposal... Yep, and that's where me and Sean came in. I am not entirely comfortable with it, but it seems the best course. So let's say Virgil was part of the team responsible for getting me, for getting Sean kidnapped and Nate killed. Hmm. That was a mass. Oh, I could have just gone that way around. Okay then. You know. Yeah, I came from the restricted section. Don't don't question it. Right. So let's go talk to Lee, and we'll go talk to that um, other egghead that was above us somewhere. Yeah, advanced systems we need to get to to get Lee. Here's your evidence. Now you know that I'm telling the truth, therefore Brotherhood telling the truth, and you know the Institute is lying, confirming your suspicions. Dr. Lee, it took you long enough to find that evidence. Let me see what you've got. I went the long way around. 
you go. A holotape? This better not be a waste of my time. Mm -hmm. So let me see. Let's see your reaction. Mm-hmm. I know what I'm about to do is gonna be pretty crazy, so I'm probably gonna cause some serious damage. I have a plan. And if it works, I'll be so mm. reality sets in, does it? They lied to me. They lied to me, and I didn't even realize how far it went. All those years of loyalty. For nothing. Yeah. No matter how badly it hurts, you needed to hear the truth. And for that, I thank you. I came to the Institute to get away from the Brotherhood, from the whole world. I just wanted to do my research in peace. Father took me in and mm -hmm. gave me access to cutting edge technology that I only dreamed existed. <laughs> I became jaded. I thought that the Institute cared, that they wanted to better mankind. That's what they think as well. In a twisted way, they still do. But now, I realize if you can't trust the people you're working for, then it's all pointless. If they lied about Dr. Virgil, who knows what else they've been lying about? Or what their plans yeah. are for my work? I'll make my way back to the Brotherhood. But I'm going to have to do Yay. it. I can't take any chances being seen with you. Tell whoever sent That's you fair. that they've just regained the services of Dr. Madison Lee. Can do. Now let's Father go meet. Accomplished so much. I hope you can appreciate him hey as well as we do. Have you seen my girls? I hope they're not getting into too much trouble. Are you kids? Hmm. I'll look out for Thompson. Oh wait, it wasn't you, was it? It was Rosalind. Yeah. I can't wait to see what you can do. Right, so we need to go upstairs. I wonder if that's sin no, I can't talk about that. Mm. I can't imagine living on the surface. It sounds like a nightmare. There's three, eh? Sorry, no, I'm in the shop. Oh no, wait, that was the key word for something else. I was wondering if that synth was still around here working. One that we help in the railroad. Have an escape. Power yeah. demand jump at the number five percent. Yeah, so how, how do we get upstairs? Ah. Where are we going? Still up further. Welcome to the Institute, Mail. Scary. Scary Terminator, Casa dude. And up further still. Okay. Oh, clean floor. Are your visual receptors malfunctioning? Can you not see the grime and dust? Hi, Doc. You know what happens when people get robots to do all their work? They get fat and lazy, that's what. Real people doing mm -hmm. real thinking and real work. That's the future I want. No argument here. Nice to meet someone who isn't obsessed with replacing people with machines. I've been saying for years that we're too reliant on these synths. But nobody wants to listen. Maybe you can talk some sense mm. into them. In any case, I suppose I should say, welcome. Perhaps a fresh <laughs> perspective will do some good around here. Don't make excuses. Yeah. You're clearly defective and I intend to report this. Perhaps Dr. Higgs. What others call complaining, I call critical thinking and challenging Public assumptions. Alright. So if there's an option there, why not leave? I <laughs> thought maybe I could try and convince him as well. Apparently he's down. This person I'm looking for is down now? Nope. Dr. Falkirk? Oh. Oh, they're on the Wanda. 
They're not in any set place, they're just wandering a path. Hello? Oh, it's you. Hello, wait for me. I want to slide down the banister and meet you. I had my power and armor on, I jumped down. We don't usually welcome outsiders. I hope you can appreciate your good fortune. Doc, they weren't kidding. You really are here. Well, all right. Yep. I'm Allie. Allie Fillmore. You can think of me as the Institute's chief engineer. When Father told us about you, I could hardly believe mm -hmm. it. You've been through so much. I think most people would have just given up. If you don't mind my asking, what was it that kept you going all that time? I just wanted to find my son and keep him safe. Now that you've found him, I hope you're proud of the great man he grew up to be. Now, nope. I'll give you a quick rundown of the facilities division, and then I'll answer any questions you might have afterward. As you might guess, we keep mm -hmm. the Institute's mechanical and electrical systems running smoothly. We maintain and upgrade mm -hmm. all of the systems that make it possible to live and work in a place like this. There's a lot of machinery mm -hmm. behind these walls that recycles the air and water and provides power to the laboratory. The work we do might not be as exciting as some of the others. Mm. So, now that you're here and you've spoken to Father, does that mean you're on board? I'm not on board with anything. No? And yet here you are, poking around. One might find that suspicious. If you're not planning on staying, I'd recommend keeping your hands to yourself. Wouldn't want to give the impression yeah, you're up to something. And consider having another talk with Sean. He really is anxious to have you with us. If there's anything else you'd like to know about the facilities division, Hang I'm up. happy to discuss it. I'm good for now. I'm good for now. Thanks. Did you refer to father as Sean? Don't tell him that. You don't know him that well. If you meant the robot, then he was not anxious to meet anyone. He was anxious about meeting people. Um, we are honored to welcome you. Talk to father. Okay. And he is where? Quest. Where is it? Oh yeah, that's fine. Isn't right. Oh, he's on the other side of the. The other side of the facility. Okay. And down a level. Out of my way, coming through. Didn't ask. Don't care. Hey, Blade. Uh, why can't these be like vacuum tubes? You know, like the future armor travel tubes or the bank tubes. Scanning. I keep wanting to call him Jeffrey's tubes, you know. But I know that's not right, that's the that's the um the, the maintenance things in Star Trek. Now that you've had a chance to see the Institute firsthand, what do you think? Yeah. You've got technology here that I never dreamed possible. It's amazing. I'm glad you can appreciate what we've accomplished. None of it has been easy. Ultimately, all our knowledge and resources are focused on a single goal. Mm -hmm. The goal is best summarized by our motto. Mankind. Redefined. Unfortunately, yeah, no advancement comes without occasional setbacks. As remarkable as mm -hmm. our synths are, they can be... dangerous without proper supervision. The superior synth mind and body so why make him? to wrestle with something approaching free will can be a recipe for chaos. What do you mean by proper supervision? I mean that while they are here in the Institute, fulfilling the purpose for which they were designed, our synth which is formed admirably. As you're about to see, however, they can become unpredictable when set loose a rogue as i'm about to see mm, um, his memories have been oh fuck no i'm not doing i'm not doing this unless i have to he believes he's a man named gabriel under his leadership the raiders have taken many innocent lives I've hmm. mm -hmm. we'll bring that synth home that would be best for everyone now you should get moving mm -hmm. 
Many people are in danger, and a delay could cost lives. Yeah, okay, sure. Right, right now I am going to turn off that. And it's from within. So I'm going to teleport myself out to the airport. Because then I can get my power armor back. And me and Kate can get ourselves up to the Pridwin. Oh no, he's, he's on the... Is he on the Pridwin? I think he... We're going to go see Elder Maxon and hand in that quest and go from there, see what, see what the Brotherhood wants us to do. Come on. Let's begin chainsaw. We call it a cutter, I think it is, or a ripper. Hello! I'm back! Did you miss me? Hello, beautiful. Where's Kit? That's what I'm talking about. Hello, beautiful. Hey, this better be worth it. I need to ask you something. What do you want? Your thoughts? You wouldn't believe the goodies you can dig out of old luggage. <laughs> Didn't have anything. That's all. Sure. Okay. So, where are we going to? The Pridwin. Let's go, 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 go. Had to collect my power armor. Do I have any uh, technical documents, just out of curiosity? There's some else I can hand in while I'm here. It's C, isn't it? So. Nope, okay. So let's do this. Elder Maxon, I bring news. I received word that Dr. Lee is returning to us. Up That's me. I've convinced her that the Institute is the enemy, not the Brotherhood. Well done, Knight. As soon as Dr. Lee arrives, we'll interrogate her aboard the Pridwin. She's been under the Institute's influence for the last decade, and we can't afford to take any mm -hmm. chances. Now. I believe you still possess an important piece of data that Proctor Ingram is eagerly awaiting. I want you to bring it to mm -hmm. her immediately. Once again, Knight, you don't fail to impress. Dismissed. Thank you. Now, um, what was that? What was that quest? That was ah oh, outside the wire. Where's Proctor Ingram? Oh God, she's back downstairs. Alright, we're going down. Good. Nice to hear the the whole playing integrity is holding up. I'd be <laughs> concerned if it wasn't, so thanks for reassuring me. And... Oh, wrong side. Victorian. Woohoo! Rather than wait for the load screen. Okay, Proctor Ingram. After this, I can't wait till we start live weapons training. Okay, kid. Scaffolding. Ah, hello. Here's your holiday, Proctor. Hope the data on that thing was worth it. Thanks. You know, it's good to see you're still in one piece. I wasn't sure what the Interceptor would do to you. I wasn't worried. 
After all, I built the device myself. I have confidence in everything I built, too. But that's because I'll only deal with technology that I understand. Speaking of technology... I wanted to say that, but he didn't hear <laughs> I'll get this holotape to Proctor Quinlan. I'm dying to find out what's on it. Hopefully, it'll reveal a weakness in their defenses. That would be the best case scenario. Before we jump to conclusions, let's see what Quinlan's scribes can get off of it. I'm sure the Institute has all okay. of their data heavily okay, encrypted, so it's gonna take some time to crack. After that, we'll have to see what we've got. There's no telling no what problem. we might have grabbed off their mainframe. In the meantime, I've got a new assignment for you. So, I bet okay. you're eager to get your hands dirty on our new project. How much has Maxon told you about it? He seems to feel it's pretty important. Important is an understatement. We're pouring every resource we have into this thing. I hope it's worth it. Come on, it's this way. Unless you're blind as a bat, I'm sure you've noticed that we've been building a Max and Achilles. I can't hear what you're tip the balance when we go toe to toe with the Institute. Now, the Gridwin might be a big beast, but she's not built for fighting. That's where our new project comes in. Hmm. New project, eh? This storage bay full of parts is what's left of Liberty Prime. The Brotherhood used it in the Capital Wasteland as a weapon against the Onslaught. It's the most advanced robot the Brotherhood has ever had at its disposal. Fortunately, Liberty Prime was destroyed in the line of duty. I've spent the better part of the last few years piecing him back together. And if you think that was easy, try rebuilding a Protectron while you're blindfolded. Oof. In order no to get thanks. Liberty Prime fully operational, we're going to need your help. Sure. No problem. I'm sure this only looks worse than it actually is. Huh. I wish I had your confidence, <laughs> because this is not going to be easy. Now, the good news is that we've got most of Prime's parts fully assembled. The bad news is that it's going to take more than a few rivets and some spot welding to get them working again. And the first problem mm. is the CPU. It's fragile. Every time we try to feed power to it, it blows itself out. Oof. I assume you can fix that? I wish it was that simple. If this happened to one of the robots on the Pridwin, I'd just swap out its fusion pile. As much as I hate to admit it, Prime's power systems are out of my league. Luckily, you were able to convince Dr. Madison Lee to return to the Brotherhood. She was on the original build mm. team for Liberty Prime a little over a decade ago. I've already spoken to her, but she's reluctant to work on Prime for some reason. If you could get her down here to lend a hand with this power system, we can get the big guy moving. Okay, so that's why she's like, she didn't want to work on Optimus Prime. Yeah, absolutely. Of course. What's on your mind? Appreciate it. We've been on the road together for a while. And we've taken some hard knocks. But through all that crap, mm -hmm. I notice you've always been sticking by me. You know, watching me back and making sure I don't do anything stupid. I think maybe it's Ye. time to tell you a little bit about who you're traveling with. There's no reason for us to keep acting like we're strangers. I appreciate your trust. Well, you're the first to earn it. It all starts with two oh. bits of humanity, I suppose you could call me parents. I'm convinced I was a mistake, Oof. because I can't remember a single moment that they treated me like their daughter. I was yelled at and beaten. Everything I did was wrong. Nothing but a nuisance in their eyes. The whole time I was telling myself oh. that they had to love me, even if it was just the tiniest bit, because they never kicked me out. Then me 18th birthday arrived, and I found out why they kept me around. They slapped a shock collar around my neck and sold me to slavers. They didn't even Jesus. care about me to say goodbye. Eighteen years of suffering through that shite, and all I was worth to them was a pocket full of caps. Jesus, I am so sorry. God. I'm so sorry, thanks. But there is more to this story. It would be easy to oh God. Five years. 
broke this vibe of my goddamn life. The things they made me do. The way they use me for their amusement. It sickens me to me stomach mm. even thinking about it. But I bided me time oh, God. and learned to use their own methods against them. Stealing a few caps out of a sleeping man's pocket is a piece of cake. As long as you don't get greedy. Mm. I can't even imagine having to go through something like that. You think that's slow? Just wait. The story gets much okay. worse. It took every oh God. Of patience I had. But after five years, I had finally pocketed enough to buy me own way out of there. But instead of heading nice. off to try and repair the shambles of my life, I gave in to me rage and I headed home. You can imagine the look on me parents' faces when I kicked open their door. What you can't oh. imagine is what they looked like after. After I emptied me gun into them. Sounds like justice to me. Was it justice? Or was it murder? When I close me eyes, all I can see is their faces twisted with fear. And then my mind starts wandering and I start judging myself. And it's ripping me the fuck apart. Think I inject myself with all that shite and drink myself drunk because I'm a tough Irish girl. I do it so I can forget and move on with my miserable life. So there you are. Mm. The entire flawed package known as Kate. Stripped bare for your perusal. Hey, I'm proud of you. I knew I was taking a chance telling you all this. But I never expected you to say you were proud of me. I, I... I think I needed to hear that from you. Thank you. I'm not going to flirt. <laughs> not, not right now. It's okay. We're friends. Look at me. Now you have me blushing. Well, that settles it, I suppose. Friends it is, then. Hope I make you a good one. Otherwise, I'm going to look right the fool, aren't I? This is that sells it, friends. It is. Then could I have done a could I have done a romance thing then? All oh, right, that's yeah, I leveled up. So what am I gonna? I could boost my charisma. Yeah, especially if I've got to try and convince Lee of things. What else? Oh, there was a strength thing, wasn't there? Yeah, where's Superman? There he is. I need to 46 for that. Uh, no, I don't want to use action points to run. Uh, no, let's just let's put my charisma. Let's see. Hmm, my points in vats would be good. Uh, recharge rate of crits. That could come in handy as well. Yeah, okay. Right, we're auto saving. So I can ask about our relationship because for some reason I can't do that in power armor. Hey, point out what you need and I'll get right on it. Excuse me. You need to talk. What are your thoughts on our relationship? You and me versus the Commonwealth. I'd say those are damn good odds in our favor. Didn't have anything else. 
No problem. Hey, Kate. You get back in it? There she goes. Oh, I saw. Yeah, Bobby Pin just killed. Getting in? Brilliant. Now, what we can do very quickly before we head up to the Predwin, since we're fast travelling anyway. Oh, wrong corner. We head ourselves down to Virgil. Give him his serum. And then. No, you're right, it's not. Um, oh, there it is. Try to find where the door was. Yeah, then we'll fling ourselves up to the Pridwin and talk to Proctor Quinlan? No, um. We'll find out. It'll point in the right direction. Ooh, you have a magazine. Ooh, energy weapons, just five crit. Nice. Hey, Virgil. Well, <laughs> I'm glad to see the relay didn't completely vaporize you. The interceptor worked. It was rough, but it worked. Amazing. And what about the serum? Did you find the serum? I've got it right here. That's it. That's really it. Let's see, let's see. Retrovirus is mostly density gradient is high. Recombinant counter intron sequences look stable. Transcriptive exon strands have formed. That's good. It is. But there's only one way to know if it works. Mm. Yeah, you can inject yourself with it. Considering this is, no. you know, he has to be there and everything, Wait. you think it'd be rendered a bit better. It'll work. Don't worry. I hope so. We just have to let the retrovirus run its course. I'm going to rest for a while. I'm back in a few days, maybe a week, and well, I guess we'll see. In any event, yeah. you kept your end of our bargain. Thank you. Mm-hmm. You're very welcome. Okay, shall we uh, away? Come on, Kate. We've got a date with an airship. <sighs> I wonder, it'd be a fun thing if, um, like, the different endings. Like depending on who you side with and everything, whether it, if that made a difference on Virgil's serum, you know, like in one ending it works, on another it doesn't, and another it kills him. That'd be fun. Probably that might happen. The playthrough I saw, uh, full playthrough, it was with the it was the uh, the real um, not the real road the um, the watch. Minutemen, some watchmen, the Minutemen, and he didn't even do the serum, didn't he give it back to him, I don't think. Can you believe are I didn't, he did, I think he did, but he didn't, Sims. he didn't check on him, after. or did he? I can't, I can't remember, honestly, which shows how much it meant, so, yeah, it'd be a fun idea. Let me get a random one. You know, it, one it cures him, and he lets you, have, and he says, no, "Take what you take, what you want." You know, just as a thank you. One, he's, he's gone feral, this super mutant, a, a big fight, and he can All take what you want. Technology must be presented immediately to Proctor Quinlan for evaluation. 
Anyone yeah, another found one in possession is, uh, of undocumented technologies will be subject to inquiry and punishment. Yep, yeah, something's written to me. Now that we yeah. have intelligence on the Institute, we can use it against them to gain the upper hand. Mm -hmm. If you're here to talk me into working on Liberty Prime, you can forget it. Oh, I see. What changed your mind? Nothing changed my mind. I promised you I'd return to the Brotherhood, and I've kept my end of the bargain. Okay. Uh, what do I want to do here? Do I need to remind you why you made that promise in the first place? No, that won't be necessary. Tell Proctor Ingram to get her scribes ready. It's going to take a hell of a lot of work to get Liberty Prime back online. But we'll get it done. Like you might be in the shot. You never turn your back on Gunner. I've served on this and years. It's the only part of dance love there. So, oh, question. So, let me. So, that's Proctor Ingram. And. I guess it was just us, so I had to, I had to speak to Thingy first. I can't believe that Dr. Lee's returned to the Brotherhood. I thought she was a traitor. Oh, well, you thought it wrong. She was on a sabbatical. Alright, let's, let's leave here again, apparently. I'm guessing now she's down on the ground. Can't break through them. Get. Okay. You gonna drop in after me? Yeah. Someday, I want to be the best laser rifle shooter in the Brotherhood. Good for you, kid. Okay, I'll catch up. Ooh, you have it. Thanks. Proctor Ingram. Well, things are off to a good start. Isn't that right, Doctor? I hope so. Prime suffered some significant damage to his memory. How do you beat me down here? Your people would have been a bit more careful, Proctor. The good news is that the damage isn't irreversible, and I should be able to get the power flowing into his CPU core without overloading. If your people stay out of my way, that is. Charming, isn't she? Yeah. Sorry about that, Ingram. Don't worry about it. We might be butting heads on a few issues, but I've dealt with worse. Besides, Dr. Lee's worth all the aggravation. We're working with one of Prime's original designers. I don't see it getting any better than that. In fact, since things are going so well, we're going to have you start building as electromagnetic actuators. Um, what? You're acting like I know what those are. Oh, I know you haven't the faintest idea what I'm talking about. I just like watching you squirm. The actuator allows <laughs> Liberty Prime's arms and legs to move. Prime's new limbs are way too heavy for the simple hydraulic pistons he had in the past. We're gonna have to rip those out, construct a brand new system using electromagnets, and install them in his limbs. What we need you to do is Ooh. build the actuators for us. Now that you know what the actuators are, you need to know how to make them. These are the plans and the materials list. Don't lose them. Now, before you get that look on your cool. face, you'll be happy to know that we have plenty of the raw materials on that list right here at the airport. The only thing we need you to That's head good. out and find is a high-powered magnet. According to Proctor Quinlan, the best place to find one is in any of the ruined hospitals around the Commonwealth. We've already sent out a few teams to find the rest of the high-powered magnets you'll need. They should be back by the time you return. Once you start building the actuators, you need one for each limb, so you'll need to make a total of four. Good luck. Okay. Okay, a high-powered magnet. Certain she'll be vital to the Brotherhood's success. Yeah, you're probably right. 
Okay, so a hospital then. What else do I need? Let's let's go to the. Uh, let's go to the uh, the workshop area. And see if we're close to building it already. No, is it, is it no, nothing special. So. Oh, all the radar shit. Okay. So yeah, skull for that. <laughs> Three skulls. Okay. No. Okay. So. I need a magnet, a big, powerful magnet. Search the hospitals. Hmm. Oh, there's one. Mass Bay Medical Center. And that's what we'll do on the next stream. So, thank you everyone for coming by. I will see you there on our hunt for a big magnet to rebuild Amazon. Sorry, Optimus. Sorry, Liberty Prime. So, I'll see you there. Same nat time, same nat channel. Ta-ra!